Did the old prophets actually meet angels on top of mountains? Or were they highly intelligent beings from a galaxy far, far away? Welcome to Ufology, where we explore the truth about alien life. Because let's face it, we're not alone, and the evidence is everywhere. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the significance of comets throughout history. Comets have always held great importance to humanity, whether it's for superstitious reasons or in scientific fields. Some people even believe they can lead us to discover extraterrestrials. If you're curious to know more, let's get right into the video. From ancient sources, we know that comets have been noticed by humans for millennia. Various people groups, including the Chinese and Greeks, ascribed significance to comets. For example, ancient Chinese oracle bones have been found that depict comets. Until the 16th century, these celestial objects were usually considered bad omens. They were believed to foretell the deaths of kings or noblemen, coming catastrophes, or even attacks from heaven. Aristotle was the first known philosopher to use various theories and observational facts to study comets. He believed that comets were atmospheric phenomena. This was because they could appear outside of the zodiac, varying in brightness over a few days. From his observations, Aristotle derived his theory about comets. He believed that everything in the cosmos was arranged in a distinct configuration. Part of this configuration was a clear separation between the celestial and terrestrial. Comets were part of the latter. Comets were within the sphere of the moon and separated from the heavens. In the 4th century, Apollonius of Mindus also suggested the idea that comets moved like planets. Aristotelian theory on comets continued to be widely accepted throughout the Middle Ages. This was despite several discoveries from various individuals challenging aspects of it. Despite Aristotle's faulty assumptions, his theory on comets was still one of the most scientifically rigorous. Many people were much more superstitious. In various cultures, it was believed that the gods dictated the motions of the world. They believed these comets were sent as a message. What were the gods trying to say? One interpretation method used images that they saw when looking at the comet. For example, some thought the tail of a comet resembled a woman's head with long flowing hair. This was a symbol of mourning it meant the gods were displeased. To others, elongated comets looked like fiery swords blazing across the night sky. This would herald war and possibly glory to a king in battle. A message like that could strike fear into weaker nations. It could also inspire the strong to pursue greater conquests. These comets played a large role in dictating the lives of those who witnessed them. For example, the Mandate of Heaven. It was an ancient Chinese belief that the emperor had favor from the gods. Ominous astrological phenomena, along with natural disasters, meant that the emperor had lost this mandate. Rebellions and unrest would soon follow. Up to the 15th century, astrological interpretations of comets were prevalent. In 1578, German Lutheran bishop Andreas Calicius defined comets as the thick smoke of human sins kindled by the hot and fiery anger of the supreme heavenly judge. But he had his detractors too. Andreas Judith stated that if comets were caused by the sins of mortals, they would never be absent from the sky. It is also believed that divine beings somehow came down on comets. These were beings like angels or creatures from beyond our world. Who's to say they weren't aliens? Today, superstition around comets remains, but less so. The scientific method has removed much of their mystique. To scientists, comets are important because they are primitive bodies left over from the formation of the solar system. They were among the first solid bodies to form in the solar nebula. This solar nebula was a cloud of dust and gas that formed the sun and planets. By studying comets, we can learn a lot more about space and our universe. Even without mysticism, the appearance of certain comets still holds a lot of significance. Some only appear every few decades, centuries, or even millennia. 
For example, there is a green comet named C-2022E3, or ZTF, passing close by our Sun around January and February 2023. The last time it entered our solar system was 50,000 years ago. That's when Neanderthals walked the Earth. Imagine looking up in the night sky and seeing the same thing your distant ancestors saw. Amazing, isn't it? Some scientists also believe life on Earth was seeded by meteorites. This theory is called panspermia. Panspermia comes from ancient Greek, meaning all seed. It was first proposed in the 5th century BCE by the Greek philosopher Anaxagoras. He believed life exists throughout the universe. This life was distributed by space dust, meteoroids, asteroids, comets, and planetoids, as well as spacecraft carrying unintended microorganisms. When those objects landed on a planet, life would take root there. Panspermia was unfortunately not widely accepted in the scientific community. Critics argue that it does not answer the question of the origin of life. Instead, panspermia merely shifts responsibility to another celestial body. It is also criticized because it cannot be tested experimentally. Perhaps as our technology advances, we'll be able to test the theory of panspermia better. It would be a monumental discovery to find that humanity originated elsewhere in the universe. Maybe we'll be able to trace it back to its source and find alien life. Lastly, there are also conspiracy theorists who believe crashed comets and meteors are alien ships. We've covered various cases like this in previous videos. There have been cases of meteors appearing soon after crashing. These cases are often reported alongside sightings of strange creatures nearby. It's possible that the meteorites disintegrated. Maybe the nearby creatures were a coincidence too. But either way, we've never found out the truth. And of course, this lack of conclusion leads to even wilder theories being spun. Comets are truly wondrous objects. Some see them as omens from heaven. Some seek to discover their secrets via science. Some believe comets can point us towards aliens. Whatever the reason, comets will always be significant objects to study. The more we study them, the more we learn. Make sure to comment below on what your thoughts are, and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe.